What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. Hey, just bought the cheapest Olight that I've ever seen here. It's the i1R EOS, a tiny rechargeable LED keychain light, and it's only uh, $16.99. And so, as far as I can tell, as far as my experience has been with Olight, uh, it is definitely the cheapest one they've ever had. And it should be pretty simple. It's a 5 to 130 lumen light, and it uses the uh, Philips LED element, and it's basically just a little keychain light. And if it's uh, anything like the other old lights, it's going to be probably the best keychain light I've ever had. I've had other keychain lights, uh, especially even though those little plastic LEDs that you squeeze. Um, you can see here, it looks like we have a little plastic tab in here. And this thing is pretty small. It looks like the end of a baton. Uh, the, the light on the end of a baton. It looks like we have um, instructions here. And then we have all oh, the school. I didn't know that they were including it, but it makes some sense here. A micro USB cable, old light branded with a little kind of purple anodized look and that's because this uh, flashlight is totally rechargeable so you have a little LED cable right there just keep that in the frame here and then look at the LED light right here we've got the LED element I'm gonna really get in on this because this thing is really small you can see it there a reflector uh, really high quality aluminum construction uh, some knurling on the top and the bottom because this thing works by twisting and then as you can see uh, it's even marked here so off uh, counterclockwise and then clockwise to get to different uh, levels and we have a little keychain ring right there Olight logo right there so first thing is I think we're, this is how we'll take it apart I can feel there's an o-ring right there you can feel it you can see there there's the micro USB port so you could just charge the sucker by taking off that cap and sticking this sucker right in there and charging it, which is awesome I love that um, you know I love when they're rechargeable like that and then oh there the little thing fell out when I took it off so that's good now we'll have the connection here and I, and I assume maybe there's a little bit of charge so I'm gonna twist this until we get to on okay so there it's it's off right there and you can really make it sure it's um, uh, off completely by kind of keeping it a little loose but as you can see here the arrow represents the back part and so if we were to twist this we go on right there so now I have this uh, one or I one R light on so you can see I think that's the five lumen state but that's pretty bright that's pretty bright no problem lighting it up in this very 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 well lit room right now and if we go here can I twist keep twisting it boom wow that really stepped up kind of washed out my light there and now I'm assuming this is the 130 lumen and that is really <laughs> bright like I said I've got umbrella lights in here and the whole nine yards and you can see how the exposure has changed on my camera and then uh, you just twist it like this to go back down to lower level and then off completely awesome I'm totally stoked about trying this out let's uh, take it out in the dark and give it a try you're in the darkness it's actually raining a little bit uh, so I thought I'd just turn on the keychain light here and oops, twisting it the wrong way sorry about that and as you can see man this thing works look how little this is it's like a pinky absolutely would click clip onto keys uh, perfect light for even hiking I mean you know five feet out in front of me I can see you know everything just fine and if I twist it down here in one-handed operations just fine man that does get pretty bright so you know like I said look how little that is uh, 120 30 40 50 lumens you know isn't necessarily a lot but it's everything that you need in the practical range um, even the trees out there are being lit up pretty well and so I have more than enough power to to light up what I need to see while hiking walking navigating a camp site uh, working in a car you know changing a tire in the middle of the night so really awesome to have a, a powerful well built uh, keychain light you know particularly because there are so many of them that are really cheap uh, little tiny LEDs uh, just kind of little plastic things um, you know the, you get to, with this an Olight product made out of aluminum you know a super uh, super bright super powerful little little piece but with all that construction and quality that you can count on and rechargeable um, all the feature set that you get on the bigger flashlights built into it so I'll put a link to it in the description uh, I would definitely check this out Peter Von Panda, out.